Hi, this is Natalie again. Just want to say hi um, and give you an update on the Malaysian kinky straight wig. Um, which one is it? Is that one right? All right, it's this one. This is the 20 inch Malaysian kinky straight. She is doing very well. I think it's been a month because, yeah, it's going to be a month. Three weeks to a month. And she is doing great. Usually by now, when I buy wigs from other vendors, by three weeks, I, I, I don't like the hair. It's tangling. It's You have to comb it constantly. This one, you do not... I don't have to comb it throughout the day at all. Hardly, hardly, hardly. You know? I hardly have to comb it. Like, I go all day without having to comb her. Um. Anyway, like I said, I tried to dye her um, burgundy up top and leave the bottom the natural color. It seems to me that natural color is number two. Um, so, I tried. It looks black in the house, but outside it's you see it in the light. And um, you see it in the light. So the top part is red, burgundy in the sun, and then the bottom is a number two. But in the inside the house, it looks like number one with two highlights. Okay? So she's doing very well. I'm trying not to use her too much, you know, since she is a full lace. And um, this hair is definitely real. It has split ends, which I love. It has split ends. I don't see any thick plastic hairs in it. It's soft. It took the color. Not the way I wanted it to, but I mean, this hair is super, super amazing. So I'm trying to not use her too much. <clears throat> All right, now that other kinky curly one I showed you before that looked horrible um that was like up to here and I said that's not no way that's 22 inches that was looking like 16 or 18 inches I sent it back and I got a refund and remember the other one I told you was um, um stop mat was a uh, a yaki but it looked like silky hair so I sent it back with the other wig and I paid them to um make it kinky straight and there were synthetic fibers in the wig. But I don't really see any that I can find right now. Um, I haven't worn her yet since I got it back. I've just put her on a foam head and pinned her down. Um, I mean, she saw... This is supposed to be Peruvian hair. But this is the first time they sent me a wig that I had. I saw synthetic, synthetic ugh, fake hairs in it. Um, but I haven't seen any more. I saw like maybe three near the top. And that's really it from what I see. Um, so I will come back and review this one. <clears throat> and I'm so done buying wigs. Um, Alright, so when I got the refund from the other kinky curly wig, I showed you the new wig last week. I had sent them a picture and I said to them, do not give me kinky curly. And they gave me kinky curly. Anyway, I wanted more, maybe of a water wave or a super deep wave. I didn't want spiral i wanted more s with less tight um you saw the video with me on i don't know i just i'm not feeling this wig i am feeling how soft she is this is a malaysian kinky curly um her softness no synthetic hairs whatsoever natural color number two it's number two for the natural color i think it's still too light for my skin color matthew stop um so it's not worth sending wigs back, honestly, to China because shipping is like 40 bucks now, 38 something with them, post office. And then by the time you, if you do order something else, another 30 bucks to mail it back to you, it's, you lose 70 bucks ready. So I am going to sell this. I don't like it. Um, it's gorgeous. I washed it in front of you. You can comb it out. It gets very big. Um, right now there's no mousse in it. It's a very soft hold. I went to the store and I bought the Jerry Curl juice. <clears throat> yep, I did. And it was like $6. I sprayed it because it smoked so the ends. I sprayed it and look, it looks great. It looks so nice, but I just don't like it on my head. And I asked a few people. I asked like six people. And only one person said they liked it. Everyone else said, mm, I wasn't really feeling it on you. So, um, when I used to wear weaves and braids, I used to wear the wet and wavy. That suit me. But this one, it's just not suiting me. Um, in my opinion. So if you do want to buy this wig, it's really, really nice. I mean, look at it. It's gorgeous. Um, I washed it again. I put, you know, look at the video. It's really nice. I wouldn't lie to you. Um, 
and you have to know how to take care of kinky curly hair but out of all the kinky curly wigs I had this one is the most nice with no synthetic fillers and not ridiculous amount of um tangling or whatever she's really nice knots aren't bleached full lace stretch uh yeah really really nice wig but I don't know look at the video and see if you agree with me I'm just not gonna wear this wig so why should I keep it? I'm not gonna wear it uh what did I pay for this wig I think I paid about 370 to 400 dollars for this wig so <clears throat> I'm gonna take a loss and sell it for three either on eBay or on here if you like it let me know um check out my feedback on eBay Natalie 1977 I am um, good feedback because I don't lie about the wig. If the wig is tore up, I say, look, this wig is not good, $100. If it's real nice, it's 300 bucks. If it's in between, you know, 150 So this one be 300 bucks. Wore it once or twice, and I just don't like it. Um, I like how it looks. I like how it feels, but I don't think the curl pattern suits me. So, um, this one's really nice. All right. What is this? Is, oh, yeah, this one. This one's new also. This one, so this is Malaysian Kinky Curly. This one is the Malaysian Kinky Straight that I've been showing you that I, you know, flat iron and curled with the little rods. This one is my favorite. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> and this is the other one from the same company, right? Put this here. Um, one more wig. The Oh yeah, I already talked about this one. This is the one that I sent back. I didn't like the texture of it. Um... To me, it looks like they just braid it and put perm solution on it. Uh, yeah, so I have to wear it. I haven't worn this one yet, okay? This one is new. Where's the comb? This one is new. It's my first time wearing it today. Um, and it did fine. Um, it was still too thick, so I did the same thing I did last week with the other wig. Was um that I parted and then flat ironed, you know, parted didn't flat iron parted and flat iron to make it less thick but I left the top and the underneath kinky to look real <clears throat> um I, don't, I had a little trouble making this one look real I don't know why um it's showing a little bit I might have to cut a little bit more lace off of this wig but I actually this is shorter than the other one. I'm thinking this is 18 inches. I'm thinking this looks a little bit more natural, too. It's not so long. It's not so long. But it's nice. I curled the end and I flat ironed a little bit of it. This is, they said 1B, but this is definitely number 1. Okay? I'm babbling again. Um, but I'll let you know how this one holds up. It's for the same company, so I'm really done with the wigs. No more wigs. My credit cards are max. Stop, Matt. Um, oh, yeah. Sorry for my babbling. Uh, I went on Groupon and I did the the lashes. Can you tell? I did the individual mink lashes. Let's see. If you can see. Um, there it goes. Um, I did them yesterday. Normal, I think it's one twenty. With the Groupon, it was forty five dollars, and I went. Took an hour and a half. Um, this morning I woke up and I looked crazy. My eyes were swollen, my eyelids were swollen, my face was swollen. The last time I got the ghetto lashes done, no offense, the same thing happened. I took them off, so I figured with the lash by lash it wouldn't happen. So I'm thinking I'm allergic to latex. Late latex. Um, so I I took my son's medicine because he's allergic to dogs. I took his um, steroids and his allergy medicine. Twice I took it in the middle of the night and then this morning and the uh, swelling has gone down. It's no longer and I put allergy eye drops in my eyes. So so far so good. It looks nice. I think I got them a little bit too long though. This is eleven millimeters. But it looks nice. Um with the little I only put a little bit of liquid makeup over here on my dark areas. And I just then I'm just quite that. And I look really nice today. Um Stop, Matt. You want to say hi? No. No? Okay. Alright, so, if you're interested in this wig, it's very nice. I just, 
I don't like how it looks on me and I was gonna re relax and someone said don't do that so um, it's really nice hardly tangles I would suggest hard mousse because who wants this hair with the jerry curl juice it smells good it's soft and it still moves but at least the curls are held together if you like that big look I don't know if it needs to be layered and razor cut to look better but I'm just not feeling it um I'm not feeling it I'm gonna stick with what I'm most comfortable with what looks most natural is the kinky straight I'm not even gonna buy Matthew stop I'm not even gonna buy um yaki anymore because they seem always so silky yeti. the kinky straight yeti. I'm gonna keep on saying it yeti. it's an amazing texture and yeti. um once you flat iron it, it looks like relaxed hair if you really really flat iron it and keep going over and slow you'll get it back to silky but um watch out when you get caught out in the rain oh my god this gorgeous white guy i went hanging out in the village this gorgeous gorgeous white guy my my husband can't hear me freaking gorgeous i mean wow he came up to me on the train and he was like <clears throat> Um, I don't want my wedding ring because of the weight loss, it doesn't fit anymore. So he came up to me on the train and he was like, oh my God, I have never seen a black girl with real hair. He goes, I love dating black girls. And you know, you can always tell when they have a weave or hair or wig or braids. He was like, your hair is amazing. I was like, oh, well, thanks. I'm not going to say it's not my hair, right? You, I don't know you. And he, this guy was fine. Anyway, he goes, oh, look, you have something in your hair. And I, I think he was lying. So he went like this with the full length. So you could feel it even if one strand is pulled. So I faked the ouch. I mean, I don't know why he didn't notice the net because it's not the silk top, but this guy, oh my gosh. Anyway, um, uh, anyway, I just said, you know, thank you. And, uh, he went on his way. Yep. Um, but this, I really like the kinky straight. And now I'm thinking no more getting 20 inches. This 18 inch one isn't bad. It, it looks more natural than the 20 inch and um the darker hair also looks more natural the one the number color number one looks more natural okay so anyway i had a good day did a lot of things um any questions i'm not like a wig pro but i didn't really have been doing this for almost three years because my first video, Matthew, was a couple of months old. Let me see. I think November 09. And look, I'm still... I, I don't think... I don't even know how many weeks I've been through since then. But I'm going to stop. I gave my credit cards to my husband. I, and I'm like, don't let me use them. You know? Don't let me buy any more wigs. Um, yeah. Maybe just one more. Maybe... Maybe just one silk top, Malaysian kinky straight like this. Just one. For the next time someone six foot three comes up to you on the train and wants to know if your hair is real. Um. All right. So Malaysian kinky straight. I love it. I think one is Brazilian actually. This one's Brazilian. That one's Malaysian. Yeah. No more Chinese for me. No more Indian. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm babbling now. I have to get to bed anyway. If you like this wig, it's gorgeous. It's uh 22 inches, supposedly 22. It's long. Um, it's nice. I just don't like how it looks on me. Look at the video, you're gonna agree. You don't like how it looks on me. I look better with the straights. Um, and there's so much you can do with the kinky straight. You can fire iron it, put rollers in it, and it looks real. People don't think that's your real hair. Um, but I do think the shorter you get, the more natural it looks. Like after 18 inches itself, it mm, 16 looks really real in the kinky straight. It really does. Um, all right, so this is Natalie. Bye.